You are playing with fire, fool. Furious Duchess Sophie destroys Megan after she drags her in Endgame. Hello, truth seekers, and welcome back to our channel, where we reveal the shocking truth behind the glamorous world of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Ladies and gentlemen, viewers of this channel, and those who follow the royal stories, today we find ourselves standing on a precipice, dangerously precariously close to the edge of a story spun by none other than the self-proclaimed victim, Meghan Markle, and her puppeteer, the royal family. Prince Harry, Duchess Sophie, a stalwart of the royal rank, has been dragged into this vault of deception and manipulation thanks to Omid Scobie's recent book, Endgame. But before we move on to any other details, I would like to thank you very much for all your immense love and support. And in case you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, well, what are you waiting for? Hit the subscribe button now, and don't forget to click that bell icon. Perfect, so let's get started. So now, I usually don't wait in the tumultuous waters of royal gossip, but when blatant untruths threaten to tarnish the reputation of someone as esteemed as Duchess Sophie, I can't stand idly by while Meghan and Harry try to do something. Your game is up, and I will not forgive your manipulation. You're playing with fire, and today I am the torchbearer. Let's dissect this so-called revelation that Sophie, Duchess of Edinburgh, unknowingly had blind faith in Meghan. The audacity of such statements is astonishing. According to royal insiders, Sophie tried to offer an olive branch to Meghan during her early days as a royal. Some offered hours of advice and an open invitation for further advice, hardly the actions of a blind royal. It was reported that Meghan, after gathering pearls of wisdom from the Duchess, disappeared from the royal radar. There wasn't even an invitation back to the Frogmore Cottage, a stone's throw away that would have been extended had it not been a one-sided relationship. I don't know what Duchess Sophie is. You deserve much better than this game, though. You deserve better than this whole thing, with gratitude. So now let's talk about Scobie's description of Sophie's reaction to her interview with Oprah Winfrey. According to Scobie's Endgame, Sophie nonchalantly dismissed Oprah and said that if you don't go on talk shows, there's no reason to know who she is. Harry and Meghan hinted that a senior member of the royal family was concerned about the color of their son's skin. They conveniently drop names that leave a cloud of suspicion over the entire family. But when Endgame hit shelves, the Dutch version reportedly named not one, but two high-ranking members of the royal family involved in this unpleasant incident. Meghan and Harry, you're in the grip of selective memory, and your calculated emissions are really catching up with you. The pieces of your story are falling apart, leaving cracks in your carefully constructed victimhood. And now, you've ensnared Duchess Sophie in your web of half-truths. I stand with you today, Duchess Sophie, as you weather the storm of deception. Harry and Meghan, your house of cards is falling apart, and I will no longer tolerate your shenanigans. The royal family deserves better than this stage drama. Viewers should not be fooled into questioning stories that claim truth and let the chips fall where they can. Concluding, Meghan and Harry, you are truly playing with fire, but this time, this fire is leaking into your own facade. The charade ends here, and the truth will prevail. Duchess Sophie stands firm against the blowing wind of truth, and it'll extinguish the false fires. You have suffered so unfairly. So what do you think about this news? Do share your thoughts in the comment section down below. Let me know what you think. Stay tuned for more shocking stories and revealing scandals on our YouTube channel. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to stay updated with the latest information from the royal world. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you again with some more juicy royal news.